So here you can see over time, I have made a lot of fresco projects right here. So once you make these fresco projects, what happens is that it automatically syncs up with Photoshop that is installed on your computer. So over here, if I were to go to Photoshop, you can see under recent, I see the same set of files. So I can actually go over here, let's say for example, uh, let's say uh, in the tree, uh, um, uh, on the tree drawing right here, and you can see that even the layers are here and I can make changes right here. Let's say for example, I can go over here and then add a new layer just like this onto Photoshop and then I can go around and then just draw around just like that as if this was a Photoshop document right here. So I made the changes. Let me just press Control S right here to save it out and now I can go back to Fresco right here. So once I go back to Fresco, you can see that uh, the tree drawing right here, it has been updated with the scribble that I made right here. So it's directly compatible uh, with one another. So I can go over here and make some changes just like this. Let's say, for example, I go over here and draw something out and go back. So it is saving the document as you can see there. And over here, let me just close this. Let me just close this and go over here onto home right here. And you can see that the update has been made right over here. So that is how you can directly integrate between Photoshop and Fresco. In order to do it manually, you, can, you have to go over here. In case you want to do it manually, let's say you have Fresco on one system, Photoshop in another, um, for example, then you can also do this. You can open any document and then click on export right here. So click on publish and export. And what you can do is you can export as and in format, simply select PD or PSD, which is a Photoshop file extension. So I'm just going to click on export right here and I'm going to export it on to my desktop right here. So it has exported the document right here. So now I'm going to go over here on the side, just like this, and then open up that document. So let me just close this. I'm going to open up the Photoshop file on my desktop. So it's the Fresco file, as you can see, the masking and everything else is here. So I can just go around and make the changes. So I'm just going to add a new layer and then make the changes right here, just like that. And I'm going to save it. So once I save it, it has been updated. The file has been updated right there. And now what I can do to import it back is to click on import right here and then choose the file, the PSD file and open it up. And once I open, what happens is that the updated file has been imported out into Fresco. So you want to work along Photoshop and Fresco side by side, then you can easily do that by these techniques right here. So you can see that they are very um, uh, integrated among one another. If you want to learn more about Photoshop, you can check out my tutorial series on Photoshop as well. And that is how you can integrate Photoshop and Fresco files together for editing. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.